Welcome back to another installment of How Fast Is This? We've just finished repairing the Solex. I'm not sure if this will be the video right after that, but we've just repaired it and it runs. So I'm going to take advantage of that and do a little test drive and see if we can do some quarter mile times. These probably will be pretty slow, but I'm going to do it anyway, just for uh, completeness of the lineup. So without further ado, let's take it out and go for a spin. I'm getting ready to torch this bloody thing. I think we found the issue. So we have the carb here, and in this hole to mount it on the inlet manifold there is this plastic I'm not sure if I should call it a gasket but it functions as one uh, so it probably seals uh, the tube to the carb but this one looks pretty bad I don't have these in spare I think I'm going to try and find some but I'm going to try it with an O-ring. I'm going to look if I have an O-ring at the correct dimension. Uh, put it in a hole and then tighten everything back down. And hopefully we get lucky and it will seal. Because as you could see in the clip, we, were, we are pulling false air as we would like to call it in here. So that's air behind the carburetor. So that's air that doesn't get any fuel. So that's why the bike would only run on choke. And if you would turn the choke off, then it would run lean, and it would run that lean that the bike even stalls. So I'm going to see if I can find anything that matches this, and hopefully mount everything back. So we just got back from trying to reach a quarter mile with the Solex after fixing the another issue with it. So it ended up being the plastic seal or gasket or however you should call it between the carb and the inlet manifold. So I have a temporary carb now for my uncles to test with. I'm going to order some parts and then reinstall those with my genuine carb. So we have the numbers here. A quarter mile took 54.78 seconds and we exited the quarter mile at 29.7 kilometers an hour so we'll do the numbers i'm not sure how much power this thing should make in theory uh, i'm pretty curious as to what the results will be for this quarter mile run i'm not even sure if this thing makes a horsepower so we'll just do the math and i'll show you so I made a little chalkboard to write down all the times and the calculations we make for each bike. So the one for the, the, the Dream are on. So we have a 0 to 45 in 8.81 seconds. Trap speed of 74.91 kilometers an hour. The horsepower with the trap speed method is 3.38. Or with the elapsed time method is 4.14. And it's theoretical horsepower. The Solex has a theoretical horsepower of 0 0.6 uh, it's 0 to 45 well it doesn't reach 45 so that's easy trap speed was 
0.7 kilometers an hour and using the same uh, calculations as for the dream uh, we have a horsepower with the trap speed method of 0 0.14 and with the elapsed time method we have 0 0.35 so these are pretty weak but that's obvious it's just a bicycle with a small engine on it but uh, yeah at least we have it so that's that on to the next one but that will be for another episode so anyway if you like this series please leave a like and uh, consider subscribing because we will we'll be doing more of these tests and thank you very much for watching see you on the next one